mother's maiden name. So she was extremely excited that I, you know, named the company after her. And we specialize in event management and public relations. I want you to take a look at this classic 1999 special collector's edition. It happens for quite some time, but it needs quite a bit. So we have brought it out for you guys. And I want to just put that up and show this to you. is that they keep working until they can't get it wrong. Some people keep working until they get it right. Okay, I'm satisfied with that. I worked that math problem. I worked on that English you know, paper, and I think I got it right. But he kept working until he couldn't get it wrong. You know, in school and in business and in life, you do have to be competitive. But it's not competitive in a negative sense, but it's competitive in a positive sense. Made it not only through undergrad, but I also made it through a master's degree as well, too. And you all can do that just as I did. Um, and you can speak to them. Uh, my dreams and aspirations are to be a football player. You know, when you're done with football, there's still life after that. This is mostly to get a 3.0 this year and next year so I can be able to go to the college level. We're also going to start a Facebook page as well. We're going to send that link to your teachers and you guys can connect with all of us. There's other professionals that are here as well too if you have questions. I'm an e-learning and web-based training development company. Have you ever been asked this question? What are you going to do when you grow up? Okay, I'm going to get a couple. I mean, developmental psychology. It works for developmental psychology. All right, good. What's the bars? Jackson like on the Minnesota Vikings? Not like that. <laughs> All right, yeah, I guess you don't like him. Anyway, uh, what you gonna do? I wanna be a physical therapist. You wanna be? Jennifer? I wanna be an FBI agent. FBI? Okay, y'all watch your back. <laughs> you don't like for the rest of your life. No, it's okay to make a change. It's okay to decide that after five years, uh, hmm, marine biology, I'm, I'm done with the fish. Okay, it's, it's okay to say after that, look, I want to do something else. But one thing that I want to stress that you should have in mind is a plan. If you guys that are doing that, ask them questions. Go to their office. Go look it up on the internet. Go find some information about that thing. Find out how much you like about it. And then, you know, if you want to give it a try, give it a try. If a little, after a little while it's not working for you, it's okay to move on, but you gotta have another plan. You can't just say, okay, I'm gonna chill and see what's coming, what else is coming along. That's one. Second thing is this. How many people have ever failed something? Okay, you failed a school course, you failed at basketball, you failed at uh, something. How did you feel when you failed? Some people said sad. Some people said, what? You felt terrible, you felt disappointed, okay? I'm going to tell you this, don't feel too bad. Failure is just a stepping stone. When you fail at something, don't feel like, okay, I'm just, you know, I, I stink. I can't do this. I'm the worst person. I, you know, don't get down on yourself. Failure is just something that we go through in life. So I started Hard Body Off of Fitness two years ago, and that's my small business. It's an opportunity for me to do what I want, and it gives me the opportunity to just be me. Uh, I do both, you know, working for the government and our body outdoor fitness. If there is something that you want to do, stick to it. You know, the option is there for you to make decisions and there's wiggle room to, to go here or to do here or to do that. But I think if you feel in, inside yourself that this is something that you want to do, stick to it. Do some research, you know, my family, I don't know, where the hat. But there comes a time where I have to put the other hat on. You know, when I get into my fitness mode, you know, when I'm in the street, I say, what's up? It's good, you know. <laughs> I'm serious, you know, it's good, you know. But then there are times where I gotta turn that off and I gotta put back on the other hat because that's what life is about. Putting on different hats in life. You know what I mean? Alright, is to look at someone's body, body mechanics, the way their foot is positioned, feet shoulder width apart, right here, pointing forward, parallel, up, right? And I want you to push your butt back and sit on the toilet. Ha, 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 ha.